Tom must have accidentally left us on air. I guess I'll start with the news. <clears throat> Welcome to the Greens, where grass grows on top of buildings. I'm Rob Peters, and today is already starting off kind of strange. There's a bell that keeps going off all the time. We definitely didn't install a new bell tower, and there aren't any other bell towers around here. Oh, actually, you can hear it now. I have no idea where it's coming from. We don't have a bell tower. And there's nowhere else where this could be playing. Anyway, it is a little weird, but it doesn't seem to be threatening right now, so let's just move on with other news things. Starting with, of course, the community calendar. On Monday, the old building that is on the outskirts of the Greens is going to be demolished. On Tuesday, we will see the death of Mr. Jeremy Stinger. He was a good man and he will be missed. Hopefully he'll be able to come to the office on Wednesday. On Wednesday <laughs> Authorities On Thursday there will be a solar eclipse. Make sure to hide into your homes and do not come out until the warning sirens have finished. On Friday, the sequel to the B-Movie will finally be released. It will also be called the B-Movie. And in fact, it'll just be the B-Movie again. It's... It, it's just the B-Movie. So if anyone wants to see the B-Movie, then... We don't have a movie theater, do we? Uh... On Friday, we will begin production of a new movie theater. I'm going to have to let the city council know about that. <coughs> On Friday, we will all meet the juggler. Wait, did I just say it'll happen on Friday? I meant on Saturday. Uh, on Saturday, we will meet the juggler. On Sunday, we will kill the juggler. This has been the community calendar. And now it is time for Fun Facts with Rob, where I tell you all sorts of fun facts about our local flora. Did you know that the tallest tree in the world is the California redwood? And the shortest tree in the world is you. Did you know that there are plants out there that look like birds? Nobody knows how they know what birds look like. Did you know that I actually have a Venus flytrap in my room right now? It is currently feasting on something that snuck into the studio. <clears throat> uh, did you know that everything is actually a plant? Yes, your science teacher was lying to you the whole time. There are no animals, only plants. You must become one with the plants. You must be the plants. You are plants. I am plants. We all are plants. Did you know that sunflowers actually follow the sun? And if they can't find the sun, then they look at each other because they are also miniature suns, all with their own planets around them. Those are actually their petals. That's right, 
Every sunflower petal is another planet with other people in it. Did you know that the most used word in the entire English dictionary is plant? The most used letter in the entire alphabet is also plant. This has been Fun Facts with Rob. Okay, folks, nobody panic, but someone has vanished. A Mr. Edward Evans has suddenly disappeared. And no one knows where he went. And I'm not sure why, but I feel like this might be the start of something problematic. The only thing we know is that he disappeared shortly after the bell tolled. What did the bell say? Oh. Oh, toll as... Okay. Sorry, I... I don't know anything about grammar. Anyway, I should probably get on with... Huh? Oh, there's the bell again. That is strange. Where is that bell coming from? I don't know what it is about it, but... It gives me a vague sense of dread whenever I hear it. Uh... Richard? Richard, do you have any more news to share? Richard? Richard? Richard just vanished. Now I'm starting to get very concerned. This is the second time that that bell has tolled and it's causing some major problems I think I'm gonna take a break from recording for a bit and I'll get back with you later I don't even know if anyone can hear me anymore I don't know if there's anyone left to hear me. I'm back from my break. Though, it's not like if you're hearing it, you would know about that. There's hardly anyone left in this town. In fact, I think I am the only one left. Everyone's gone. Jack Jackson. Dan Parks. Barry, the man who technically does not exist. Apollo, the five-headed giraffe. Other miscellaneous characters that I haven't named yet. Even the horrors <laughs> is gone. Might as well show a word from our sponsor. Hey, I'm Randall. I'm the owner of Randall Shop. I haven't been getting many customers lately. There's something to do with that new ball they installed somewhere. Uh, anyway, this is an ad, so... Uh, here at Lano Shop, we sell all sorts of stuff, and that includes bells that don't make people suddenly disappear. I 
forecast actually scratch that it doesn't matter anymore we all know what happens in the weekly forecast so let's instead do the motto of the day if at first you don't succeed then you're probably doing it wrong go Call an expert and ask them for help, and notably get disappointed when they tell you not to call them again because they're very busy and they have a lot of work to do and they don't have time for your problems. This has been the motto of the day. Oh no. seems that my time has come to an end, as is the rest of the greens. So, for one final time, from me to no one, goodbye, good night, and good luck. I guess I'll start with the news.